Majesty. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you. So make no mistake, this is Sony's time to shine. We have transformed, re-energized, and ignited our will to win consumers around the globe. With what I've shared with you tonight, we take a significant step forward at Sony. We're delivering a new world of consumer options across all product categories. Sony will continue to lead the industry's charge of 3D. That is clear here tonight. But I've shown you more than just that. It's about connectivity in the networked world. It's about developing consumer applications and delivering seamless experiences. It's about Sony being the undisputed leader in the consumer electronics industry. And ultimately, it's about consumers being wowed by their experience associated with owning Sony's wonderful products, contents, and services. Thank you very much for your time and attention. It's now my pleasure to introduce Azura. Good evening, everybody. It's really my pleasure to join you here at uh, CES. Now, after hearing from Sir Howard, Yoshoka san, and Phil, I'm sure that you all have a very clear understanding of where Sony as a company is headed in 2011. And as Sir Howard mentioned, leveraging the power of the network and to use it as a unifying hub is an absolute key to adding value to all of Sony's products. And within the Network Products and Services Group, we're focused on a clear vision of a unified network Sony experience. One that seamlessly connects all of Sony's devices for content, commerce, social connectivity, all with a very slick interface, and one that provides and maximizes the ultimate convenience for all of our consumers. We're also supporting the Sony-wide 3D initiative as well. The online delivery of 3D movies is now a reality. We currently have seven 3D titles streamed on Curiosity, as well as available for download via the PlayStation Network. And we will, of course, continue to add more titles and expand our library of rich entertainment content through our network services. Sony is also in a very unique position for our ability to bring native 3D gaming to all of your HDTVs. Content that is purposely created just for 3D. One very relevant example, of course, is Gran Turismo 5, which is arguably one of the biggest franchises for PlayStation. And in the two weeks after its launch in late November, Gran Turismo 5 has sold more than 5.5 million copies worldwide and has served as a lightning rod for 3D content in the home. And of course, there is more amazing content on the horizon. Killzone 3 is coming out next month, and we're going to continue to support 3D with our biggest franchise. Now, one that was recently announced is the sequel to the multi-million selling 2009 Game of the Year. I'm pleased to show you the very first look at Uncharted 3. Take a look with your glasses. <coughs> of their minds wake in the day to find that it was vanity but the dreamers of the day are dangerous men for they may act their dream with open eyes to make it possible for. It might just get you. 
Perfect. Sony will continue not only to support 3D, but remains committed to setting ourselves apart by having the most robust network services and product portfolio in the industry. It is not only a corporate mandate, but a mission of mine and my, my group to really make this happen. And within the network products and services group, we focus on services that, not, that connect not only to the internet, ready TVs and PlayStation 3s in your home like we do today, but will have services that empower and connect many Sony devices, especially those in the mobile market that have become so pervasive in both the consumer and the enterprise spaces today. And to that end, we're very focused on the growing mobile market and not only connecting those devices, but also ensuring that the mobile experience is a satisfying one for our consumers. Now is an incredibly exciting time as more and more products are created and enhanced for each and every situation encountered by every type of consumer. And we're investing heavily in this area, and you can expect to see significant and strategic products and services from us in the very near future. We're tapping all of Sony's resources for this, and we will deliver connected devices under our mobile initiatives. Our new mobile strategy encompasses driving the development of a variety of new strategic products and services including tablets currently in development, as well as smartphones. All the while, of course, integrating the know-how and the assets that we've accumulated from our PlayStation In 2011, you will start to see an implementation of a strategy that we've developed and continually refined over the past 18 months. And you will see this strategy executed in the form of great new products and services coming to market that leverage Sony's strongest assets. In addition to launching a line of Sony tablets, we'll be building upon the video, music, game, and book offerings on our Curiosity and PlayStation Network services to deliver a compelling, unique experience for Sony across a wide range of consumer electronic devices. As Sir Howard has emphasized, this is a position that only Sony is in, and we know how special and unique that is. And so we're taking an incredibly wide view of this opportunity. And we will deliver an unparalleled experience in both our hardware devices and, of course, our underlying connected network services. So now, let me get back to Curiosity. We have successfully launched video on demand powered by Curiosity that's available not only here in the US, but also in Europe as well. All of the major studios have signed on to be a part of our video service. They understand that when our powerful network service, like Curiosity, marries with all of Sony's network-enabled products and our understanding of consumers' needs for a seamless entertainment experience, well, let's just say that it makes for a very appealing proposition. And as you've heard from us tonight, content is vital, but it's obviously not just limited to video content. And that's why I'm so proud to announce that Music Unlimited, powered by Curiosity, a new cloud-based streaming music service that provides access to more than six million songs is being incorporated into several Sony products. We started the rollout in the UK and Ireland last month, and Music Unlimited will also be available in the US and Canada, as well as the main European markets within the first quarter of this year for 2010 and 2011 broadcast televisions, Blu-ray players, PlayStation 3, and Vio PCs. Your Music Unlimited experience is not only going to drastically enhance your Sony devices, but also unify that experience and your content across all of these devices. It will enable you to listen to your favorite music, sync your current library with those devices as an extension of the music you already own, and offer a very powerful opportunity to discover new favorites streamed straight from the cloud 
and we want you to show you a very quick demonstration of bringing your music across these devices. And to help me do that, I'd like to welcome Ine Nishino from Sony Network Entertainment to the stage. Ine, can you come to the stage? Hi all, as Kaz mentioned earlier, uh, Music Unlimited is our new streaming music service available on a variety of Sony's connected devices and PCs. Today's demonstration will showcase the experience on the PlayStation 3. Okay, so we're very all uh, very excited about this, and so thanks for helping out today, Nishima san So can you walk us through some of the uh, services starting with what kind of music is available, and how do I find the music that I want? Okay, absolutely. But before jumping to the demo, uh, I'd like to touch on the, uh, one of the important aspects of our music service. Um, I suppose you have your own music rock and roll library in your PC only. Yes, I do. Right? So, with the Music Unlimited, you can basically sync your library to the cloud and access from any device which is supported, including PC. That is one of the uh, big, uh, important aspects of our service. So, well, I can have my library up in the cloud. Yes, yeah, sure. And in addition to this music sync feature, Music Unlimited has a library of over 6 million tracks, including music from all of the major levels. Finding the music you want is very, very easy. There are many ways you can navigate through to find exactly what kind of music you're in the mood to enjoy. For example, where, where, where's my computer? Oh, sorry. I can't do anything without this computer. You need so this is my my demo. So you um, get it back to this. So <laughs> you can sort through premium channels like this way, and for free populated playlists such as a global top 100, where you may discover your music or your favorite artists. And also, you can find the music by genre and mood and the era as well. So let me go back to the uh, even global one. So basically, you can skip through, or uh, you can listen as much and as long as you want. This is very nice and very exciting as well. Yeah, sure, of course. And Music Unlimited will automatically populate with new releases and then categorize and recommend them to you making it even more convenient for you to discover new music. Of course, you can always search a, song, a specific song or artist. Let me do that there. So this is the main menu. Go to the search and type it in the Elvis Presley. I'm going to search uh, Elvis Presley album. The search, um, I can find the Elvis Presley albums. And also, I select what I want. And all of these songs come up for a listening page. This sound looks great. So will Music Unlimited learn my preferences over time? Yes. Uh, let me go back to the uh, Global Top 100. So while you're listening, you can like or dislike this using controller or sound. But you can see in the behind, there are some notifications on there. Yeah. So Music Unlimited will learn your behavior and customize your music recommendations over time. Okay, that's great. So I can create playlists on my bio and then enjoy them on my Sony HD TV, Blu-ray player, or the PS3 in the comfort of my own room. Yeah, that's right. And that's the best part. Um, your music playlists are synced across all of your music unlimited devices, instantly giving you full control over your content on all of your devices. And this service will be accessible through music.qrilcity.com, music.curiosity.com, when the service becomes available in your country. Great. Thank you very much, Lisa. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I hope that uh, you will agree that Music Unlimited is a definite value add for Sony's network products and will enhance your content experience across all connected devices. This is going to be a major initiative for Sony. And speaking of all shook up, to close to, to close today's close today's event, I'd like to introduce a gravity-defined, heart-stopping extravaganza, which is a unique tribute to the king of rock and roll. Not only is Elvis Presley's iconic catalog a Sony music entertainment property, but Sony's professional cameras and equipment shoot this exhilarating live every show here in Las Vegas at the Aria Resort and Casino. Ladies and gentlemen. Please welcome the cast of Viva Elvis, the latest production of the world famous Cirque du Soleil as they perform Bossa Nova. Thank you very much. 